Hey, well, one more event for your consideration. It involves performance art and gasoline. It's called Gas Station Theater, Ghost of Gasoline, and the man behind the series is Seattle lawyer and electric car owner, Mr. Matthew Metz. Hi, Matthew. Hi, Nancy. Good to see you. Okay, so in 2014, you founded uh, the nonprofit Cultura, right? And that's the umbrella organization for this performance series. Correct. Yeah. What Cultura, why did you want to create this? Well, cold tour is about getting people off gasoline. Gasoline is one of the biggest public health problems we have. It's also the main driver of climate change. Mm -hmm. And w we thought that the arts, that theater could reach people in a way that ordinary talk and argument couldn't. Things like s our actors hold a gasoline pump in their hands. Mm -hmm. And that's a, what consumers hold in their hands too. So there's a kind of a relation there and a, and a reality that just doesn't come across when you're talking facts and figures. Just kind of pointing your finger and lecturing. Right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So this is the second year of Gas Station Theater. The theme is Gasoline Visible. Uh, what message are you sending out this year? That it's time for people to make a plan to get off gasoline and, mm -hmm. and to, to really look at gasoline in their lives and how they can start to purge it from their lives. Which you have done uh, yeah. to a certain degree, yeah, right? Exactly. With, obviously with the electric car. Yeah. And, and so instead of just talking about it, you're doing something about it. Yeah, and it's really easy. I think that's the biggest misconception is how easy it is to get off gasoline. Mm -hmm. And once you start realizing that everywhere you go in a gas car, you're leaving a trail of, of junk behind you, then it, it starts to get easier to make that switch. Right. Well, um, okay, so the Gas Station Theater, Ghost of Gasoline, you have two more events coming up, uh, September 21st at the Wallingford Shell Station. What time is that taking place? That's at 7 p.m. 7 p.m., okay. And then the biggie is October 2nd. It's a citywide mock funeral procession from Seattle Center to the Pike Place Market in celebration of No Gasoline Day. And also, Matthew handed me this thing. And I, can they get this thing online? Yeah, they can. Okay, this is how you basically pledge how you're going to not use as much or drive as much, Yes, yeah, right? it's, it's a plan to get off gasoline. So okay. it doesn't have to be this year or next year, but it's say, hey, look, in three years, I think I want to buy an electric car or I'm just going to get rid of my car. You know, it's, yeah. it's, it's a plan. Okay, so on your on the website, they can get this. Yes, okay? I can. All okay. right. Hey, well, thank you so much for coming by and, and singing the swings with me. It's right. really great to talk to you. Uh, and that is a wrap for our first show back. We are so happy to be back in the saddle with you, and we look forward to bringing you lots of great local art throughout the season. And to that end, we're going to leave you with one more little moment from Art Zone Live at King Street Station. So we asked two really great guitar players, R.L. Heyer and Kathy Moore, who usually play electric, uh, to play acoustic for us. Uh, we were hoping that they would absolutely shred it, and they did not disappoint. So enjoy. We'll see you soon. Okay, should we? Come on, swing. Okay. Ready? <laughs> and we should do this more often. See, this is a way to travel. <laughs> we should travel this way. This doesn't use gas.